Yeah. What's going on? Let's show you everybody what I am doing besides melting. I had a leaner. I'll try to put a picture of it into the still homesteading here. Every time I'm off work, not every time, but almost, I'm doing something here. Well, every day, at least some, most of the, not all my day. Weekend, we worked all the weekend. Anyway, I had a leaner. And it way out up there, and you couldn't even pull your truck. I couldn't drive my tractor. The limbs was hitting it right here, and it went past those trees way up there. And I just hurt my back loading it into the bucket. And the dogs want to play. Skid them. Kill them. I'm just kidding. That dog will get you right there. Say, come on in my come on in my house, see what happens to you, bruh. Bulldog. She's like, I'm gonna get you. Anyway. Oh, I just hurt my I got real bad nerve damage. And a pinched nerve, I know I do, because I gotta go to the doctor about it. Another bad back problem. And I've hurt my back again, so I said, you know what I'm gonna start talking about? I always say I'm gonna start showing what I do, but I never do. I put these down just to keep it from rolling over me when I'm down here working. Yes, hold on. I'll just talk a few minutes. I mean, it was past that tree up high, that high. I've done butchered it. You're gonna say, oh, look how tall that stump is. Yes, it's tall. Look at how big of a stump's back there. They've logged back through here before, so the bugs are terrible. Well, I couldn't safely make a path that way. And this is, you can't tell, but this is up higher. So I made me a little, see my little walking path that way, not this way. So that's what you get, and I'm not ashamed to show my hinge. It's not perfect. I could see what I did wrong. I had my aim right. It landed real literally. I wanted it right there. I didn't want it over here. I didn't want it to the right and hit the fence. And it fell right where I wanted it. I noticed it pulled, and it pulled out pretty good, though. I mean, that's a more than, what, 20%? But, or that's not 20% of a hinge, but I think it's good enough because it leans so bad that I got to about right here and I seen it move. So I just walked away and let her go. I could have honked, honked it and cut it more. I don't care. I don't care, that's my hinge wood. I don't cut trees for a living and I still can do it pretty good. All right, so, I don't know. If you look, it's just, just a 14 inch diameter. I don't know about at the bottom that is. I done measured it. Oh. But we have acres through all this woods, like acres. And you see down there, I don't know what that is. I know exactly, that's my box trailers. And you'll see it soon. I'm making a cutout right through here and I'm gonna push back some more for my trailers. My trailers were hid till I got rid of all the trees and I'm gonna cut right through here and the driveway is gonna be here soon. But whew, I had to quit working a minute. My back is killing me. God. That's wet, sopping wet somehow. Look at that. It ain't sopping wet, but it is heavier than a mother fricker. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take it over there. You see my big burn pile? I ain't, this is gonna take what, you know, it's gotta dry out. <sighs> Stupid bugs are all over me. So it's a, it's a lot of work. I've done been doing it. So this is what I got left. So I'm pretty proud with my, or happy, not proud. <laughs> well, how far I've done, I'm still wearing my Husqvarna chaps, my Husqvarna helmet, Husqvarna chainsaws, cut this, my 455. I got a 460, but it's sitting over there. So I just wanted to update y'all, that's what I'm doing. I don't know if you care, if it's boring you to death, I don't care, I gotta, I gotta take the rest of that stump, it's embarrassing me, it really is. But the dump truck couldn't even get in through here, cause it, if you looked at some old video, oh my battery's getting ready to die. That's why I can't make no gosh dang videos. Every battery I got just keeps dying. I want to go buy more. Look how far I pushed back. 
All right, a piece of chicken grease. I'm gonna say it now because this battery's getting ready to die. So we'll make this as long as we can. Because I gotta go do that and then I gotta load all this up and it's already six or seven. I've done work today too. See, I even went back that way. So I have cut, <laughs> I've pushed all that with a tractor. Now this was all grown right here where it's nice grass because I pushed it back a year or two ago with an excavator that I rented. This hideous monstrosity will be on soon as I can get it cut. It's an old apple tree. Then you can see my trailer. Then it'll be nice yard. And we're waiting on concrete still. Five foot out to build the building. So it's on hold until the concrete company can't even get concrete in. He told me till the 19th of this month. So I'll update y'all when the concrete gets poured and the building will be here. Then I'll make a series about how we're going to set that up. And then I'm trying to price a lean-to, enclosed lean-to. And we're running out of time to pay. We're going to pay from that building to the front all the way. It's over 100 yards. But everybody's backed up. Everybody wants a fortune, too. We was going to concrete it. But anyway, all my babies is up there out of the way. I wasn't about to let my trucks hit my tree land on it. But yeah, homestead's coming along, boys. Homestead's It ain't a homestead. We are not living off of the land. This is just, what do you call it, a forever home, I guess. We're going to push a lot of this back like this. Keep watching. You won't even recognize this place eventually. I just, I should have done been doing it and you wouldn't recognize it now. Especially the house and this and the extension should start spring. So I'll, we'll just go in and, oh, I got to cut these beautiful trees right here. You see these two big ones? I mean, they are co-dominant, both of them. That one on the right has a little bit of rot there. I don't want to kill them, but that's where the extension of the house is going out. So we don't want that on top of the freaking, it's going to be two stories. If we can get the architect to get it right. The two story extension, we don't want that on top of it. I don't want to lose those either. Because we got a big giant window in the kitchen. giant window in the kitchen it's got such a nice view and you can't see nothing but that field of field of hours right there so anyway i'm gonna go dump this logs and i'm gonna burn that burning is almost over the 15th or something so i've only got a few days i gotta do it this weekend so there goes my uh, yeah the mean dog not to me that dog loves me but anyway they got a smaller place here. They did have about. Ah! About. <laughs> Have y'all seen how much the other hat? That's your mother house. Anyway, that's it. Looks good out here where they hayed. I was thinking about, you see this tree line up here? That's on our property. The ones that goes all the way down is their property. It literally on the line. So I was thinking about putting a gazebo. I don't want to put it in front of their house. I mean, I could if I wanted to. I was thinking about right here on this hill. I don't know if y'all noticed, that's a pretty good size hill because there's there's a big new house right there and another big newer house right there. <clears throat> but you can't see them during the spring. It's Cause this way it's pretty as can be. I like to build something high up and then I could see the interstate. That'd be pretty cool. Anyway, I better get going. What is this? Eight minutes, how's it even? It says it's dead, all right. Let me know what y'all think. Cause I'm gonna share the videos anyway. I don't, they don't get no views or nothing. I'm not a homesteader. I don't even know how to hashtag hardly and stuff cause I don't care. I just like the people who I talk to watch it. If y'all were wondering, that's why I've never really grown my channel. Maybe I need to care, I don't know. I mean, I kind of care about y'all guys, but I work for a living, so. I guess some people is really good at YouTube. I need to take lessons off blades of grass. He's my favorite. Just quit, bugs. I'm going to have to spray myself down. My bug juice is wearing off. But anyway, I got to go. I need to get Dirty Filter Dave and make him do a whole lot of work. Gosh, I've got so much work to do here. It's ridiculous. Now, that ain't including shutters on the house and stuff in the house. 
one of the basement windows right there they're new and it's got claw marks all over it and dirt so i think that raccoon i seen out here is trying to get in the house well the basement all right i still haven't used my mark 2525 lst this is what i use today you know why because i'm lazy seriously i need to go get the 525 lst mark ii and let y'all see what it does because i don't know what it does all right i'm gonna put my camera up i keep it in my work truck oh i'm in a ram city here all right well y'all ain't never seen the donkeys have you there's a s10 one up i filmed him the other day he could not make it it's funny see all the anyway peace and chicken grease